Hey everyone, <laughs> so here we are again. Our next box is turkey. turkey. Not the food turkey, the country. <laughs> oh, that'd be awesome if you got cooked turkey in here. I know, right? Alright, so yeah, um, this is going to be different than our first turkey box because. Everything they sent us is completely different. Yeah, last turkey box we got Turkish Delight, and now we don't. <laughs> I know. <laughs> this is going to be so different. Alright, dude. Are you ready? Just do it. Alright, so we're going to oh, start God. off with the Barrett Spice Cracker Chips. Let me find them. Got to find them. There you go. Alright, show them. They look crispy. <laughs> They're called crispy. Yeah. Alright, do you love plain boring snacks? If so, well, you're going to seriously hate these crackers. Or these cracker chips. And the rest of this box for that matter. Every cranny of these rigid browns is packed with bar barat. A blend of spices that is insanely popular across the Middle East, and especially Turkey. In fact, you'll hear locals describe spicy hot food by saying "baratil," which means seasoned with spices. <clears throat> like m many traditional spices with multicultural roots, barat ingredients differ from place to place. Turkish barat usually contains some mix of onion powder, parsley, garlic, thyme, and paprika. It's mixed into condiments incorporated in hundreds of meat and veggie recipes and served atop tables as a way to take any dish from meh to mmm in seconds. <laughs> Alright dude, you ready? Alright, well... Mr. I have a stuffed nose. <laughs> they, they, they smell spicy. <laughs> Alright, dude, let's do this. Let me grab me a small cracker. It looks like a cracker. It does look like a cracker. Yeah, and crackers that you get. Yeah, it looks like that. Alright, you ready? Wait, you grab the other one. dink it? <laughs> hey, I got the other half. No, you didn't. You ready? not bad it's really not bad it's not spicy not spicy I just hate the taste <laughs> go ahead call those other ones <laughs> I'm not calling shit <laughs> not yet all right let's mark them I like them it's in between <laughs> you gotta stop doing that I like them Alright, so next, we're going with the yes. vanilla tahini hava. <clears throat> hava. Hava. I think it's hava. Yeah, that one. Wait, hold on. Just before you feel heavy that is. God damn. <laughs> what the, what the fuck? <laughs> hold on, listen. <laughs> Alright, vanilla tahini hava. Turkey's crumbly sesame sugar tradition. In Turkey, it doesn't get more iconic than hava. The extraordinarily crumbly ground sesame plate. confection locals have been loving since the 11th century. We need a plate. Yes, we do. A famous, we're cut it on this. A famous enthusiast <laughs> was Suleiman the Magnificent. The Ottoman Empire's <laughs> longest reigning sultan. He built a special kitchen next to his palace called the, the House of Hava. Okay. Where at least 30 versions of Hava were produced, including the tahini version in your box. It turned out to not only be the sultan's favorite, but the favorite of the entire empire. <laughs> Just maybe it'll be 
<laughs> your favorite favorite from the box. You can kill God, somebody so with dense. this. You could kill somebody if you hit them hard enough. No, you do not. No, no. If you like grabbed it in your head and, and just no. slapped them. <laughs> do not. I mean, we're gonna eat it, so there's no point. I can't kill somebody with it. Just, just don't. We no. We you will not kill anything. No, there's no killing. But you can. A, there's a possibility. No. All right, you ready? Hold you, on. You didn't open it. Stop dropping that damn thing. Any scissors? We don't need scissors. We don't need scissors. You say that as you. We don't need scissors. We do not need scissors. We need a knife. I don't need a knife. See? Just open it that way. That's how you open it. Shut up. I'm going to touch it. <laughs> we don't even need scissors. You need a knife, though. No, we don't even need a knife. And you literally <laughs> use a knife. They can't see it because exactly. you use it off camera, but they saw you flip it open. No one saw anything. I saw it. I saw everything. Oh, that's interesting. It's a rock. <sighs> Disgusting. It looks like dough. It does. It, it <laughs> looks like a solid piece of... Of dough. Pizza dough. <laughs> Not pizza oh, dough. Oh god, it's <laughs> Stop! <laughs> Alright, we're gonna cut a little piece. Well, how do you smell it? Alright, go smell it. This one actually smells good. I'm gonna cut a little bit. It cut really smooth. It's like butter. Just disgusting. I wouldn't say butter. Just disgusting butter. Not even disgusting butter. <laughs> How do you know? Because, I mean, look at the cross section. Give me that. It smells good? You well, it'll it? smell good up close. <laughs> you might think it? I like it. <laughs> yeah. No, that that's actually really do. <laughs> that's actually really <laughs> That's actually really good, dude. No, I'm gonna finish yours. It's good. It's like, um. Terrible. Mm -mm. Hate it. X. No. <laughs> like a. Like a coffee toffee. Yeah. <laughs> it's really good. <laughs> it's dry and it tastes disgusting. How do you like that? It's not bad. It's not bad. I I hated the first two things, <laughs> and you like the first two things. Well, that's why it's okay. You and I'm me. gonna like this one. That's why it's you and you and I. Which one is it? All right, cocoa cream mosaic cookie. There's only four of them. I can feel it. <laughs> Featuring Turkish tahini. <laughs> oh my god. Hazelnut and cocoa. Cocoa. Take a bite of this cookie and you'll taste a rich, smooth cocoa filling Ooh. unlike you've never had before. And there are a few reasons for that. <laughs> Tahini, a traditional Turkish paste of ground sesame seeds, adds a touch of earthiness and that creamy nuttiness. That's hazelnut, which of which Turkey is the world's number one pr producer. The country accounts for 75% of the global supply of okay. hazelnuts. This smells good. You already opened it? Yes, you didn't see me open it? Alright, mix these two Turkish specialties in their rich chocolate good goodness. And Hurry up, you, read. You've Faster. got one extraordinary cookie. Or four, actually. <laughs> yeah. You want to cut that one? No. We just want the whole damn thing. <laughs> Alright, I'm but cutting mine. Have. I'm cutting mine. It smells like, I, I don't know, the, uh... Oh, it's crispy. It smells like the, uh... Oh, look, there's something inside. 
chocolate. Yeah, there's a filling. There's a filling. There's a filling. Nice. You know, it? It's, it smells Can like it? it smells like Kinder Bueno. Who? Kinder Bueno. You know Kinder Bueno. No, no. Dibs. <laughs> I'll give you that. It's sweet, but it's not too sweet. And it it it's got a it it's soft but crunchy. It, it's really good. You want the other half of mine? No. Okay, well, <laughs> I call dibs on the other two. <laughs> I call dibs. You want that? No. All right. Can we I'm cut gonna it have in half? one dib left. I'm gonna take the one you want. What do you mean you have one dib left? Dib. Oh, you look, only have bro. three dibs. Remember? That's number one. What do you mean? I didn't call dibs on the first one. You gave me dibs on the first one. You don't want that? You want it? No. <laughs> <laughs> you called dibs on those two. No, I called dibs on that one. <laughs> you have two dibs. I have three. I called one. <laughs> oh, oh, yes, 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 yes. That's only one. Um, There's only next. one in the entire pack. Next. Oh, I read them wrong. <laughs> yes, you did. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Salted roast roasted chickpea. <clears throat> I don't know if any of um the the people watching <coughs> have ever had. Like, um, oh my god, what's it called? Chickpea. Oh, what's it called, though? Auto nuts roasted and salted yellow chickpeas. Uh, no, that's not, that, that is not what I'm talking about. I anyway, about. I can't think of what, what it's called. Egg. You, you can't walk down a Turkish street without seeing bags of Lovely. <laughs> swear to God, dude. Lovely. 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 Roasted chickpea, hanging from from stall roof. Roasted in special. Roasted in a special oven to make them non-greasy, soft and creamy. These chickpeas are absurdly popular. The only difficulty is choosing what flavor to savor. This is made out of metal. I can bend it and it'll stay in place. It's made of metal. And? And it's made of metal. And? It's so it, it stays fresh. And there's one stuck in the top. <laughs> Some are hot and spicy. Other type is seasoned with dried cloves. And others are slathered in sugar. But sometimes... Simple is the best, as the salty nutties, nuttiness of these downright stop. <laughs> downright addictive, the <laughs> blebly will, will prove. I'm sorry, we have Parrot. kittens that are attacking everything. No, you don't need scissors. We need the scissors. No. How did you do that? <laughs> Let me smell, let me smell. Yeah, please smell. <laughs> Did you say no? <laughs> Did like you just said no? Okay. <laughs> yeah, take one. Thank you. I'll grab both of them. I don't even want to try. No, you have to try. No. Yeah, you do. <laughs> take it. Dibs. Dibs, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't even want that! I'll trade you. <laughs> I'll trade this, dude. Here, I'm gonna be I'm gonna be nice. Put your hand out, I'm gonna give you some. <laughs> no. Wait, wait, wait. Those are actually really good. That aftertaste though, right? <coughs> okay, so both of us like the one before. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> I put a U instead of <laughs> Alright, let's see what's next. Here, put your cat here. 
Oh, here you go. Nope. The oh. coconut and coffee yeah. snowball cake. It's just one giant snowball. I know. See how big it is. See how big it is. like half a baseball. Yeah, almost literally. Alright, so coconut and coffee snowball cake. Speckled with turkey's famous coffee beans. Oh, you got that bitch open quick. <laughs> oh. Oh. Does it smell good? <laughs> Look into the bottom of the turkey's coffee cup and you will see something unusual. Tons of powdered beans. Turkish coffee is specially made with unfiltered coffee beans, whoa, which are ground to a fine powder and simmered with sugar water in a long, a long-handled pot called. Oh, that's very. Sesbe? I'm sorry. I'm sorry, <coughs> Turkey. I'm sorry. Sesbe. Oh. This result: a supremely thick, rich, and aromatic coffee. That's like this yum. Just as the coffee beans make Turkish coffee special, so do, so to do real coffee flakes make this white chocolatey coconut cake supremely rich and decadent. Okay. Oh God! Back. It looks like coffee. It smells it, like coffee. It looks like coffee. It smells like coffee with caramel. That looks like coffee. It looks like coffee. <laughs> oh, wow! Look, dude. I'm dying over here. You, right, you ready? Wanna dink it? I need to bite over this. It looks <laughs> crummy. I know. Mmm. 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 I would call this, but there's only one in that. Mm hmm. Damn. Mmm. That's some bullshit for them to only send one. You don't even drink coffee. Alright, we're gonna take a moment. Yeah. God. Yeah. If any of y'all need to order that off of the bus Amazon or whatever you need to order it off of. I'd suggest you do it. <laughs> yeah. I They're highly, the best. highly suggest. They're probably going to be the best in the box unless they get the other Oh, God. And, like, the, the coffee flavor was not overpowering. And there's cream in the middle. I know. That's probably what the coffee is. Yes! No, the coffee is not the cream in the middle. <laughs> all right. All right. <laughs> Mr. Gummy Man. I'm Turkish gummy sour bun. watermelon gummies. <laughs> Turkey's most mouth wa wa mouth puckering watermelon since 1967. It's jelly gum. The city of Dayakbir. Yeah. Has hosted Turkey's annual watermelon and culture festival. Why Dayak? Bakir. I'm sorry. Well, because its watermelons are the country's biggest and juiciest. Annual attendees flock there to taste them and to check out sculptures carved out of watermelon. Carved out of watermelon? Yeah. Go the watermelon weighing contest and even the watermelon beauty contest. <laughs> I swear to God. Watermelon beauty contest. <laughs> Did they just carve a pretty face in there? It could be. Call us biased, but we think this yum should win. Not only is it succulently sour, these watermelons are just so darn cute. All right, man. Oh, I didn't smell them yet. You haven't smelled them yet. It smells like perfume. Watermelon flavored perfume. Okay, you grab one. Here you go. I guess that's supposed to be watermelon. It's flat. Oh yeah. You don't dig it. You dig it. I dig it. Oh, I dig it. Come on. It's in which form? It. It's in which form? <laughs> I don't like sour shit. It's not sour. It's just very hard to chew. Oh damn. <laughs> hmm. 
Mm -hmm. It's not really that sour. Dibs. It's like really not that sour. Dibs. Dibs. It says sour, but it's not sour. Dibs. It's really not that sour. Okay. There's, there's nothing sour about that. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we do that last bit. Alright. Are we skipping the ones in the bag? You wanna skip those? Yeah, skip the ones in the bag. All right. Oh god. <laughs> then I guess that's no, the next let's one. not skip them. Let's keep going on the yum bag. Nope. No, nope. Nope. No. Leave them out the yum bag. <laughs> All right, toasted paprika corn nuts. <laughs> this I'm not really happy about. Your face. Corn nuts tossed in spicy tur Turkish paprika. <sighs> These corn nuts take us to the Black Sea coast, a mountainous area in northern Turkey known as corn country. Why? While wheat thrives in the rest of the country, it can't grow well in the damp climate and steep rocky coastline. Coastline. So corn is king. It's eaten in every possible form, from corn soup to corn bread to a breakfast of melted cheese and corn milk. I could probably I could rock that. Called malama. Malama. M U H L A M A. I'm guessing it's malama. Dude, oh, I, there's so many. Awesome. No. Oh, and these paprika toasted perfectly... Wait. I'm sorry. And these paprika tossed perfectly toasted corn nuts. Of course, what are you waiting for? When in corn country, do as the locals do. Eat them. I guess. I mean, I like paprika. I don't want to smell it. You have to. It's going to make me sneeze every <laughs> Okay, I like, like I like paprika. I like cooking with paprika. Ding it. Ding it. Ding it. And that's corn. I undid that and I did these. <laughs> <laughs> you undib the candy to dib the corn. <laughs> I did that. I hate you and everything you stand for. Thank you. But temperament. Those are really good. I, should, dude, the, dip them. the paprika flavor <coughs> is strong. <coughs> like, <laughs> it's strong. <laughs> it's strong. But it's nice. It's really nice. Alright, man. It's those. That's not those. That's not these. Those are those. Stop eating those. You need these. The delight. I think it's a big one. Oh yep. god. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> okay. Alright. Ooh. Ooh. Ah. Date. Two of them at a time are spicy. <laughs> That's the paprika. Anyway. Uh, date Ma'amul cookies. Oh, they're cookies. Like a Fig Newton, but with real dates. Okay. During... Oh, God. I oh, I'm so not trying to fuck y'all's language up. I swear to God. If y'all are from Turkey. Eid al-Fatir. The Islamic holiday marking the end of the Ramadan fast. Oh, the streets good. of Turkey smell like two things. <laughs> butter and dates. <coughs> Keep going. Why? Because everyone is baking Ma'amul cookies while Ma'amul ma 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 can be stuffed with all kinds of nuts and dried fruits. After all, their name means stuffed in Arabic. Dates are the go-to for <laughs> for Eid. E-I-D. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Please, don't hate me. These yums are so soft, buttery, and gooey, there's no tastier way to celebrate the end of the fast. These are bussin'. <laughs> no, dude. <laughs> Come on. That is bad. 
Oh, wow. Ooh. Show them. All right, so we opened the box and... That's what's in the box! What's in the box? Over there, Chill, dude. You seem excited. I am. It's like Big Newton. All right, just do. Just, just <laughs> Huh. Got the Rona. You're not gonna oh, give me one? They smell like, oh, uh, oh, uh, what are they? What is it? Oh, no. It's like the bars and they have like fruit in them, what I say, you know? The mm -hmm. Fig Newtons? No, not that. It's like, comes in a bag and they're famous and it's like a snack, but it's like apples and it, it has like the cream in the middle that's made from the, the what is it called? Big Newtons? No, it's not a Big Newton. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. I really don't. It's These a, are Fig Newtons. It's like a bar, and it's in a, like a tiny bag, and you buy them at school. Oh, I know what you're talking about, because it, it's in the bag about that size. Yeah. I know what you're talking about. What is it? But I don't know the name of it. Okay, I don't eat healthy It stuff. smells like that. Does it? Yeah. You don't know what it smells right. like, though. So why you dig it? All right, here we go. It's crunchy. But it's good. I can't do it. I undid this. <laughs> you can't undid. <laughs> you can't. You gotta stop undibbing. Too bad. These are really good. Like, these are really good. <sighs> They're not stupid sweet. Perfect there is right a perfect balance between the 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 bread and the date. Like wow, that's beautiful. That's beautiful. <laughs> I just saw it in there. <laughs> All right. Do -do 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 -do. All right. Ice cream gummy. Yeah, ice cream gummy. I'm still chewing the last one, man. <laughs> Stop it. All right. Ice cream gummy. Oh, there's a blue one. Well, blueberry, strawberry, and vanilla creamness. There's only one blue one. No, you can have it. But there's, there's only one blue. In, in summertime, what? locals don't just buy ice cream. They make ice cream. <clears throat> they duel for it. What? The entertaining ice cream tradition involves customers trying to take Donderma Mastic ice cream while vendors pull it away with slick sleight of hand. The ice cream doesn't fall over. The sticky mastic keeps it stuck to the cone. Lucky for you, we'll just give you these strawberry, blueberry, and vanilla ice cream gummies, complete with caramel cones. There's only two blue ones. No dueling required. When it comes to any hungry onlookers, though, you're on your own. There's only two blues. Right. Can I get a, uh, can I get a vanilla? No, you can get strawberry. I don't want, you know I don't like strawberries. With the tear, take the weird vanilla looking one. Cut this from the blueberry. Strawberry. But there's only two of these, these are rare. Mm -hmm. Alright, you ready? Yeah, you get, wait, hold on, why are we thinking ice cream is going to melt? It's gone. Wait, hold on, think, think the cone. Oh my god. <laughs> I don't like candy. They're good, but I'm not going to dip them. I don't have to look at that. <laughs> I don't like it. I don't like it. Say it louder. I don't like it. I didn't like it. <laughs> I don't like it. Say it like that. I didn't like it. Mm -mm. No. Mm -mm. Get on your side. No, that was more tart than the Here, take one the watermelon. It's supposed to be Here, tart. Take one. No, th no, no, <laughs> no. I'm good. You know you want one. No, yeah, all right, so. <laughs> shut up. 
Those are so good. We're splitting. All right, dude, you ready? Honey mustard and onion rice cakes. Yeah, <laughs> yeah your face is covered by all your stuff. Good, because I just made the disappointment face. <laughs> All right. Whole grain and finger licking honey mustard. Can I just say, put this out here? It looks like rice cakes. It is a rice cake. It's, it's a cake. <laughs> rice cake. It's a rice cake. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I'm gonna Cover die. your face, Rona. <laughs> Cover it by that bag. Here's an extra, extra sticky. Fun sticky. fact. Sticky. Every fall, Turkey produces the second most honey of any country on the planet, and yet barely any is exported. Why? Because domestic domestic demand is sky high. For a second, I thought you were about to say the Mexican. <clears throat> Don't be racist. I'm not. I just thought you were going to say domestic the really Mexican. Excuse me. We really can't blame Turks for keeping it. Not only do they have some truly amazing oh. varieties. Their Centauri honey, harvested from uh, a cave, <laughs> cost over $10,000 for two pounds. What? But they also know how to put it to delicious use. These rice cakes, coated in sweet and spicy honey, honey mustard seasoning, will show you what the buzz is about. Now, hold on. Hold on. I'll hold on forever. Right, right. I'm not going to eat it. these. Like... Wait, which, which country was it? Turkey. No, not, not Turkey, but they had the, uh, oh my god, the truffles, $100,000 truffles, and those chips tasted like absolute dog shit. <laughs> it was Spain. Yeah. All right. The disappointment Let's do this. Family. Let's do it. Oh, they don't look bad. It smells like mustard. Well, um, you're half right. That's cool. Come on, give me one. Give me, give me, give me. I need, I need, I need. Give me half, say that. Dude, they're light. They're like really light. What do you expect? Do you expect it to be a hundred pounds? It's a rice cake. It's supposed to be light. <laughs> Alright, you ready? I'm gonna take it. I like honey mustard. I don't, I've never had honey mustard. Here you go. It's spicy. Why is it spicy? The mustard. Mushroom has supposed to be spicy. That's not bad. I hate it. That's really not bad. No. Did you say you hated it? Yes. Dude, just throwing it over here does not mean I'm calling dibs. You understand that, right? <laughs> Yeah, I know, but in my head, I've only called, called I've only called dibs to those cookies. <laughs> <laughs> well, we only got few things left. Mhm. Mm All right. <clears throat> mm, I'm ready. Mm, Orange yeah. and cocoa cookies. Mm. All right. Top with citrus and cocoa sprinkles. Woo! Like no, seriously, they, they have woot. Let me see, let me see. Woot. 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 <laughs> January and February are exciting months if you're a farmer on Turkey's Mediterranean coast. That's because all the way from Izmir to Hatay, it's time to collect a citrus harvest. Nearly 80% of the country's citrus fruits are grown on the Mediterranean coastline with its mild, moist winter. That's perfect for oranges, lemons, and mandarins. Why is it shiny? So basically, each bite of these cocoa-sprinkled, orange-filled tartlets is like tasting Mediterranean sunshine. Close your eyes and take a bite. It's really warm shiny. Yet? It's shiny. All right, well, take one out. It looks like glass. Hey, right, we'll take one out. I don't want to eat it. You can eat it. <laughs> Oh no, we're eating it. Yeah, it's not. This is a fam. Well, that's pretty <laughs> cool. It's like a little tart. Look at it, it's shiny. It is shiny, but it looks like a little bitty tart. I don't know what a tart's supposed to look like. Like that? 
Oh, mine has even more. Dude, it's soft. Mine has even more cocoa on it. It's soft, though. It's, like, really soft. Oh, you're gonna cut your arm. I might as well just eat this one. Yeah, okay. it's soft. Um, okay, well, fuck Dinkin. It really saw. I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't like it. We have not been doing this. All right, there's the orange. I had the orange the first thing. <sighs> mm -mm. I got it the last. I got the last note of that. The orange is like, it actually tastes like orange, but the cookie. Mm -hmm. If it was just a cookie, it would have been good. But it, they put the orange in there to make it healthy, which destroyed the taste. That's so strange. Like a lot. <laughs> that, like, that's a lot. That's a lot strange. There's, There's a lot, lot going on. <laughs> There's a lot going on there. Alright, um... Give me another one of those. I want to try those again. Wait, the... Yeah. The, the crispy? I'm going to refresh the taste. <laughs> How are you going to re reset your taste buds with that? Did you already call this one? No. The only thing I called... I, I did V. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? New rule for next box. <laughs> Once you call dibs, that's it. There's no undibbing. That's only but for you. these are really good. Those are really good. Like, no doubt about it. Those are amazing. Alright, dude. We gotta do our bag now. I did V. I can do the bag. I'm just big. All right, crack it open. All right, we're looking for the mastic toffee. Mastic. Yum. Um, we just okay. Yeah, we'll cut it in half. Taste the rare Turkish oh, phenomenon. Oh, it comes with a sticker. It is a sticker. It comes with a sticker. Okay. Okay. Yeah. I'm going to give this one to my friend. No, I'm going to keep it. Just kidding. <laughs> what, do you want to name him? Huh? Name your friend. Yeah. Keep that right. one Mastic toffee. Dripping off the trees of the island of Choice. C-H-I-O-S. Choice. I don't know. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Choice. Well, yeah. Choice. You know what? Fuck it. You'll find something fantastic. Mastic. While locals are obsessed with the gummy sap and all of its refreshing, tiny glory, they put it in everything from liqueurs to food <laughs> to cosmetics. Most Did you of, say liqueurs? Yeah. From liqueurs. Liquors. To, no, liqueurs. It's a different spelling. It's liqueurs. Liqueurs. To foods, to cosmetics. Most of the world doesn't even know it exists. That's because it's harvested almost exclusively in choice. I'm sorry if I, I, I'm pronouncing it wrong. Hence the island's nickname, Sakiz <coughs> Adasi, Island of Gum. Even though the island is no longer owned by the Turks, Turks. Greece claimed it in 1912. The rare flavor remains a local staple. Take a bite and decide how fantastic is mastic really <laughs> what is that face <laughs> that's like the most unsure you've you've seen it all smells night like a, a one star of your hotel room mixed with mint wait one star of my hotel room one, one star hotel room <clears throat> mixed with mint oh for fucking sake You want half of it or I don't want any of it. <laughs> well, you gotta have some of it. It's definitely a toffee. Alright, um, <laughs> Did you hear the pop it made? And there's That was the plate. <laughs> well, <laughs> when you say it smells, man, you might want to keep all kind of flavor in there. Why is there a black part on there? Think it. That's from that. Hold on, let me bend mine. I can't. Jake, I'm not 
how, how does it taste? Not bad. It's mean, really not bad. It's not bad. You're just being. It's not bad. But you just lick. <laughs> put it back in the bag. <laughs> it's really not that bad. Because you're putting that in your face. Alright, nothing? I like it. That, that wasn't bad. Like, it wasn't super sweet. It had a really good flavor to it. This is the last one. The very last one of the entire box. Okay. Alright, melon and lime chew. Okay. Alright, wildly juicy lime meets sweet soft melon. Turks aren't just mad about watermelons, they love all kinds of melons. To the point where they where every city has its flavor. A oh, favorite, I'm sorry. <laughs> favorite. <laughs> the honeydew, like cassava melon, is favored in the city that inspired its name. <laughs> cassava. Meanwhile. Okay, well that sea has a little thing underneath it. Alacasia loves the bespeckled. Alicati melon, and yeah, I'm not even no. K i r k a k a g a c. No, they've got so many little things over the letters and under the letters. K i r k a g a c. Can't go without the green spotted K i r k a g a c melons. Your ticket to Turkish melon mania. These Mathorin chews with their juicy melon inside and zingy lime outside. Ah, oh, dude, cut it! Do you want the whole thing? Yes, I want the whole thing. I, I'm gonna take this much. God damn it. <laughs> Alright, take your shit. Just the way you were struggling. Did you already eat it? Hmm? Dink it! You didn't eat the last one, dick! That's actually really good. Dibs. <laughs> That's actually really good. Dibs. I can call dibs or something. You don't got the only piece. Dibs. Dibs. That is really good. Dibs. Damn. That's really good. The video is already 43 minutes long. Mm-hmm. Dang, time goes by fast. When you're having fun. All right, so we need to finish filling out our <coughs> questionnaire. Damn. All right, get your uh, marker. There you go. It's under this trash. All right, so coffee yes. cake. abso fucking lootly. What's the next one? I can't <laughs> see. All right, what's that one? What was that one? Watermelon. Oh, yeah. The watermelon was good. That one was good. That one was good. That one was good. Move your damn hand. <laughs> I can't see. <laughs> You're struggling. <laughs> damn it. <laughs> Dude, all of it was actually pretty good. It really was. Except for that one because you Did thought you it sucked. Did you say you hated this one? No, I didn't. Did you say you strongly disliked this one? Which one was that one? The ice cream one. It wasn't terrible. The ice cream one wasn't terrible. I really like the pop out. Alright, dude. So we can't save this. You want you can have it. to cut the coffee? Yeah, yeah. Oh, I can have it? Yeah, because I'm going to eat the corn things. <laughs> <Just> oh. <yeah. laughs> Don't spit it out like I did. <laughs> Don't do that. Mm -mm. Ain't going to happen. Because I'm going to make you leave that clip in. Mm -mm. Dude, that was so good. You need to find those on Amazon. You need to find these on Amazon.
<laughs> Those are really good too. Those are really good. All right, everybody. So that turkey. was turkey. Yeah. Turkey. <laughs> 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 All right, we love y'all. I think I'm booba though. <laughs> <laughs> I can feel it going down my leg. Freaking! smell it anyway oh god thank y'all for watching we really appreciate it like and subscribe if you appreciate it do you have anything to say it is not no no all right y'all all right jason peace and love put that back in your mouth all right Peace and love, y'all.